Greetings fellow 50p collectors, Coin Snatcher here. Um, an update on the Isle of Man Christmas 50p collection. Seeing as I can't keep my hands off these Christmas 50ps, <clears throat> we have another one to add in tonight. So there's not many spaces left, in fact none on that tray. And we only have two spaces left on the first tray. So if we go up to the top row, we have the 1980 Isle of Man Christmas 50Ps. And we've got two spaces, one for the 1980 AD die mark and one for the 1980 AE die mark. Managed to get the AF die mark and there's a few others as well. So the one, oh, that's no good is it? We'll have to turn that round straight. That one's a little bit off as well. So the coin that has arrived today is this coin. And in keeping with the theme, this is a 1980 Christmas 50p. And of course, the all important die mark on this coin. So if we have a little zoom in on it, just over to the left of the man standing behind the carriage, we can see a little A and a D beside it. So this is the AD die mark 50p. I think this is one of the rarer ones. It's uh, taken a while to track this one down, but finally one came up and I was able to get it. So the AA die mark and the AB die mark coins are numerous. There's an AC die mark as well, which I wasn't aware of before, but I have been made aware of that in the last couple of days. So I have to try and track down an AC die mark, but I've never ever seen one. This is the AD, and then there's also the AE and the AF. So these are the harder to find ones. And again, apart from the stateless mule, which has a BF die mark, and a normal 50p, which also has the BF die mark, this is definitely one of the rarer coins. When we flip it over to, it's in really nice condition. So you can see there just a little bit of dirt on it, but nothing a quick wipe with the old magic cloth wouldn't sort out, but a really, really nice condition coin. So we can pop this one into the collection. We'll just pop off the little lid here and we'll flip this little bit of card over. And I'm now faced with a dilemma because I need another two spaces for the stateless mule with the bf die mark and the regular coin with the bf die mark i need another space for the ac die mark as well so i need another three spaces but <clears throat> as you can see totally out of room so i think the time has come i'm gonna have to purchase another red tray and start to fill that up with with variants of the die marks of the christmas 50ps but for now, we've added in a really nice example of the 1980 Christmas 50p, the AD die mark coin. That's it for now. Oh, I see Change Checker have opened their their uh, <clears throat> competition where you have to send them a, a photograph of your 50p collection. So I think I might have a go at entering that. Anyway, that's it for now. Peace and love. Coin Snatcher out.